guys, Keaton here. So we're back at it again. This time I got a new weird phone. So in case you guys are new around here and new to the series, I love my weird phones. I checked out a phone that was made by Pepsi. No joke, you can see the Pepsi logo on there. I even checked out this 90s touchscreen brick phone that somehow belongs in 2017. And then I even made my own phone. So all that's sweet. And you're probably saying to yourself, Keaton, yeah, dude, like this looks like a weird phone. Here's where it really gets you. There's a shaver on here. Let's do it. See, so yeah, guys, this right here is weird phones. If you guys want to check it out, links down below. It's not too expensive. It's honestly on the cheaper side of weird phones that I've picked up. This thing is kind of a trip, and I didn't actually expect to get this. If you guys find any other weird phones, just tweet me at TechSmart. And guys, I'm even starting to respond to comments not only here in the first 30 minutes, but over on Twitter more. So make sure you guys are following me over there. This thing is crazy. And here's where it gets even crazier. When I turn it off... And now when you turn it on, it also does the same thing when you turn it off. What is that noise? Song? I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you guys have any idea. But that's the sound you get every single time when you turn this phone on and you don't have a choice. Pretty weird, right? Let's just see how weird this phone gets. Yo, there's a shaver at the top no joke there's this cap here so you can use it as a regular phone and it doesn't look too weird you could probably travel with it if you have the cap on and then you just slide this power button here the shaver starts now what's trippy is i checked out this iphone shaver it just plugs in with the lightning port right there no joke i'm not even gonna get it off this plugged into the iphone this thing's weird though because it is its own phone and my iphone just really wants to be in this video no, you're not weird enough. So looking at the phone, we got some weird stuff on here. It's not actually a touch screen, which to be honest is not that weird at all. It's $36, so that kind of makes sense. We got buttons on here, which are kind of like that old style Nokia buttons. I got the new Nokia 3310, compared it to a real one versus a fake one. People actually want these phones. These buttons are in demand. So someone actually wants this. Now at the bottom, this is where things get really crazy. I don't know if you guys can see this too well, but there's actually a USB port built into the phone. That's how fat the battery is. So you could just really charge your anything from here. I have an iPhone 7 Plus, bam, plug that in. This red iPhone video, still my favorite, best looking phone of the year. Make sure you guys look at that one. Cool. So now we have a USB battery bank built into the phone. And we're not even done yet. On the back here, you see that kind of flash? It looks like a light bulb. You guys are in for a treat. Look at that. That is a freaking flashlight. This bright on the back of your phone. Look at how bright that is. Sir, uh, have you been uh, making some YouTube videos tonight? Like, of course, yes. How you doing? Nice to see you in my sombrero, looking all fun. This phone feels so rugged. You can access the back of it back here you can see how fat that battery really is and then at the top you got your shaver six and a half hours later so guys the more i'm playing around with this phone the more i'm realizing how weird and crazy it really is and i always say that like every single video but yo there's a shaver on top of here and then there's a camera why is that a thing you could just throw this in like your travel kit and be good to go and speaking of cameras when we open this up not gonna lie opening this up is a little difficult here's the menu they didn't copy Apple completely on this like they did with the lighter phones. Man, those videos. A phone and a lighter, now we got a shaver and a phone? We're on our way to something really great here. So hopping in the camera right here, I don't know if you guys can see this too well, but I have it all pulled up. I'm just gonna bring in the Pepsi phone and see how that goes. You guys can see a little bit. Get the phone shaver in there. Yeah, kinda, it's a little difficult, but I'll take a picture. Honestly, speaking of pictures here, 50,000 likes in the video. Drop a like right now. I will use the shaver part to shave some of my hair. Some of it off, not the entire thing. I still gotta do the fidget spinner one, which we are almost at. Make sure you guys go like that video. 100,000 likes and I said I'd put a fidget spinner in my hair. At this point, I could be using this to do that, but I'll cut my hair anyways, even if I gotta do it twice. There's also a video camera on here. We're just gonna take some video of this and see how good it sounds. Yo, what's up? Can you guys see me? 
We better not hit 50,000 likes on this video or I'm actually gonna have to shave my head. I'll probably end up filming it on this phone. I don't even think the quality is that good. I think it looks pretty bad, but there is a micro SD card in the back. So that's really cool. Can you see anything? Is my sombrero? Are those colors showing up? I think? Guys, finally, we're about to do it. The shaver part on the phone. So it's not that complex. You just hit the power button on here. You slide it up and it starts shaving. Here's what I wanna know though. Is it A, a phone shaver or B? Let me know in the comments right now. A shaver with a phone. I don't really know. Phone shaver, shaver with the phone. You guys tell me and we'll see how good of a job it does. So let me, I guess, just I'll do it on my leg. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> uh, I think this is working. Yeah, this is definitely working. Oh, well, all right. You can see 110%. That I just feel bare. I just, I don't feel myself anymore. Well, it works. It works. The phone shaver, the shaver phone, A or B, I don't care which a comment. It actually works. Wow. Half this stuff doesn't ever work, but this does. So weird. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you so much, Adam N7, for actually finding the shaver phone. He tweeted it to me on Twitter, so thank you so much. I'm just at TechSmart, and I'll be using the next 30 minutes, once this video goes up, to hit all of you guys back on Twitter. So come say hi over there. Subscribe if you're new, and make sure you guys have notifications turned on so you guys don't miss when I'm on Twitter. I'll let you guys all know. I'm gonna use this and stay shaved. Peace. I'm gonna give you guys a money shot like I'm a YouTube food reviewer. Please let me know if you think this chicken is edible, good. I've had food poisoning once this year.